I'm here because the issue is extremely critical um, to the state of California. And I was also shocked uh, to hear the results of the audit, a very critical and necessary audit. And I do want to thank um, Assemblymember James Ramos for his incredible leadership on this issue, for ensuring that the audit committee um, you know, finished this audit that Obviously, um, we don't like the results, but it's important information so that we're able to continue to move forward. Obviously, there's been a lot of work uh, that has happened here in the state of California to rectify uh, the wrongs that were done to um, California's first people. Uh, but there's a lot of work to be done, and I'm proud to stand here as a strong supporter to ensure that we continue to move in that right direction of healing, of developing um, trust amongst our communities and that at the end of the day the CSU system does the right thing which is to comply with uh, both state and federal law and what is great is that we're having this hearing uh, for accountability and to get those answers that not only we need as leaders but that um, the California's first people deserve to hear directly from those that have been in charge and involved in their decisions of not complying uh, with uh, both federal and state law. And so I'm hopeful and uh, we will continue to ask the tough questions and uh, get to a place I'm hoping uh, that we can begin to, as my colleague mentioned, expeditiously um, comply and continue the great work that uh, you know, Assembly Member James Ramos has done to ensure that we rectify the wrongs uh, that the state has done to California's first people.